A longtime restaurant in business for more than six decades is calling it quits tomorrow. Yeah, the beloved drive-in is going out in style, though, with customers forming long lines and waiting hours today to get a final taste of Lou's Burgers. Double cheese, large fries, and the caramel malt. Customers lining up to get one last meal at Lou's Burgers. Here it is. The wait is two and a half hours. Thank you so much. Appreciate it. Each ordering their favorite food for what could be the very last time. I got cheeseburger, onion rings, and a milkshake. Regular burger, good onions, and... Cheese. Lou's Burgers in North Highlands has been along Watt Avenue since 1958. We've been coming here since we were in junior high. Grandparents bring their grandchildren and their great grandchildren, and they've been coming here since they were little. And I have couples that met here and had their first dates here. But owner Leland Kitchen says she's not able to pay a rent increase by the landowner and hasn't been able to reach an agreement to purchase the property. Our business is good, but we can only afford so much. So she's announced that Lou's will be permanently closing on. Saturday. It's really sad that there wasn't a deal worked out where they could stay here. Customers are coming out to show their support. It's so sad. It's going to be really disappointing to see something that's been here for so many years disappear. It makes me feel really good about what, what we got going here. Thank you very much. And good luck. It's one last burger blast for a family owned business that's going to be hard to shake. It's just kind of like the end of an era, so it's, it's heartbreaking and it's going to be an adjustment. Now, if you want to go out and support them, Lose is going to be open tomorrow from 10 in the morning until 9 at night. But they're a little worried they may run out of food, so it is best to get there as early as you can.